get to see that a little bit. I actually just got to saw it maybe a, a, yeah, really, last yeah. week. Okay. Um, I've been over at the pool swimming, okay. you know, at the, the rec center. <laughs> um, at Dixon? Yeah, Dixon at, at lunch. But no, I got to go through and I actually worked out this morning there, man. It's beautiful. Okay. It's an awesome facility and, um, you know, I think our, our players and our staff, um, we're all really thankful uh, for the people that, that donated money for that, that deal. And um, I just, I think it's going to really help us in recruiting and I know our strength staff super fired up about yeah. it too. But, yeah, it's, it's great if you guys have seen it. What significant differences from your perspective do you think will be impactful for the players? Uh, I think they just, they've made it look just sharper and updated, you know, so I think it has, uh, you know, a little curb appeal um, as, as you go through there. Uh, but they also put in all new equipment, you know, brand new equipment, brand new weights, and um, just kind of, I guess, reorganize it a little bit to where it's just, I think, more efficient use of space. But um, I'm not really, like, in there, you know, working it on the day-to-day, -day, but um, I know that our strength staff's fired up and yeah. our players are really fired up to see yeah. it, too. Obviously, Coach McDonald's working with them closely in that regard, but where have you seen the strength of this team physically? Have you seen them grow in any particular area, um, especially your side of the ball? Have you seen growth in that, in that regard? Yeah, I, I think um, we're as fast as we've been, particularly on the perimeter, you know, um, than, than, than we've been, and I, I think that's some, an area that we've kind of talked about in the offseason is we want to try to get more explosive in the offense and not have to, you know, earn a ton of first downs is be able to have guys create some, some explosive plays, and, and so I, I've seen that through the first four practices, is just guys being able to stretch the field vertically in the pass game and then take short passes and turn them into big plays, and um, I think Coach Henson, you know, has done a really good job recruiting those guys, and uh, yeah, I'm excited. We're not real tall, but we're, uh, we've got some good speed, so happy about that. What have you seen in terms of development from your QBs, especially Ben Gilbrantz and Nick Moore, both had really good days today? Yeah, um, I think, you know, Nick's been around, Nick's been around it now. I mean, this would be his, his third year with us, so he understands the system. I just think he's really comfortable out there. He's, he's playing fast, he's seeing things, and then um, in the competition period and third down, you know, drill we had today, he I think he converted four or five, so that was really good to see. And then. Ben, I think Ben's swimming a little bit. We're throwing a lot at him as far as install goes. Um, and really, he's really is still a senior in high school. So uh, for him to come out and, and uh, make some throws and do some things, I think each practice he's gotten better. He's still got a long way to go. Um, but uh, no, I'm, I'm excited about him, excited about his future. How much of the playbook would you expect, guys? And I'm sure the playbook can still change from here until you know September and so forth. But how much of that playbook do you expect guys like Ben to already have a grasp at this point? Um, you know, through the through the first four days, yeah, through the first four days, I, I mean, we've got a we've got quite a bit of what we you know our yeah. core concepts. You know, there's some wrinkles and some things that we can do off those things, but um, we've thrown quite a bit at him in the first first four days. I don't I couldn't tell you a number off the top, sure. but but. Uh, you know, I think those guys are just, it's one thing to kind of maybe take a test on it or, or learn it in the classroom, but to come out here and apply it and the defense is moving and, and you're seeing a little bit probably more um, exotic looks than you saw your senior year in high school. Yeah. So uh, I, I think he's doing a nice job picking it up and I just think every rep that he can take and every day is just, right. he's growing so much. Yeah. Seems like a pretty open quarterback battle where they're up to four or five guys plus who are getting different reps. It seems like they're they're developing a relationship even off the field where they're good with each other and they're not there's no enmity between the guys. Does it seem like that? No, we got a good room, you know, and, and uh, we got two new guys that came in and at, uh, you know over winter there, and, and uh, I think the the veteran guys were like, hey, I was in that situation at one point, and, and some of the veterans, Jake, you know. Help me, help me out a little bit. So I think those, those guys have taken taken to it, and, and when they're not in, it's been good to see them kind of, you know, uh, mentoring them a little bit through through the process, because they all went through it.